Well, a very warm welcome to you on this most pleasantly clear evening. Conditions absolutely beautiful, perfect for the beautiful game. Temperatures are kind as well, no doubt playing a hand in high attendance levels as well as an elevated level of anticipation here. Surely this is the hot ticket going around in this neck of the woods. It surely must be. This must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. And we rise now for the Danish national anthem. Which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Christian Eriksen. He's super accurate with both feet, Peter, and able to deliver a cross or a through ball with just the perfect bend or indeed weight. All this allied to great awareness and vision, which make him a massive creative talent. What I really like about Eriksen, though, is that he's got the energy and the determination to keep going for 90 minutes every game. He's a trier. Yes, getting the best out of him will count for so much. So it's down to business here. Eriksen. Now, what's he got in mind? Work on the right flank. Now, what's next? The ball has crossed the line, and it's a throw. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. Yeah, he's fouled him there. Well, I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score, and obviously he's not going to allow that, Peter, is he? There could be trouble here, but for now the referee is keeping his cards in his pocket. And so we have the first set piece of the game. He'll fancy himself from here. A long ball, but not especially accurate. Hoiberg. Forward it goes. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. Keeper. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. No messing about, just bludgeoned away. Good feet. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? 
it's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Jard battles to win it back. And he's surging through. That's great defensive work. It doesn't take too much imagination to guess what would have happened otherwise. Oh, look, his determination needed to be greater than the obstacle he was faced with, and it wasn't. If you have just joined us, well, you've missed no goals. Just brushed off the ball there. Wilson. He's through, now is he in? Good determined running there, but one back by the defence. Well, he was thinking about headlines, I'm sure, but he ought to focus more on, on breaking lines. Good challenge, he just stood firm. And he's shown him a clean pair of heels. The well, defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Poulsen. He's off on a marauding run. Crowd calling for him to shoot. That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Bit of an appeal, but nothing doing. Oh, he's taken out. That'll be a foul. And he's going to have his name taken. Finds himself eased off the ball. And it's Ericsson. Going through. Up to meet it! Oh, just needed a better contact. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. Denmark take the lead. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Well, it seems as if he's just had a momentary lapse and, and slipped into tunnel vision because he had good options around him and he failed to get his head up. Hoiberg. Plenty waiting in the middle. Up for the header! It's in! And already they're looking to run away with it. A great delivery and a finish to match. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the area department, 
This fella is definitely no sledge. So that's two now without reply. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. He's making good use of it. Shot a goal! Tries to get it forward quickly. And the first half is done. The first half thoughts. Denmark are two up and everything is shaping nicely. The only criticism, it could have been three. Denmark sitting pretty here at half time, 2 0 up. So off we go once more. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. Hoists it forward. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. A collective sigh of relief from the defence. Well, it was just some way we're passing that let the opposition in then, and I have to say, a very lucky escape. You lose it there, you expect to be punished. Oh, he's not going to get that. It was a move that looked promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. Denmark with this handy looking 2 0 lead. They are looking comfortable. Gets wrestled off the ball. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. <laughs> Gets it back. Pulsen. Battles to win it back. That's the sort of defending that is going to upset the opposition. It already has, actually. Yeah, Peter, and it looks like this defence will go tooth and nail to prevent him from, um, from getting another. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Jack gives chase. And it's played forward. 
Over to the left. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Well, that looks like a final warning, still no card. So he's plotting something before playing it in. Forward it goes. Just brushed off the ball there. Good challenge, he just stood firm. He's come loose. He's had a go! And somehow he managed to miss it. And he could have eased the pressure on his team by taking them within one of an equaliser. Ahead by two and just about into the home straight. Away from immediate danger. Delaney. Now surely. That. I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. And they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. He snuffles his third and that earns him the match ball. This is one of the best performances I've seen in a while. He's practically taken on this team single-handedly and they don't know how to stop him. So, time for changes on both sides, actually. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Denmark take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. Gets away from his opponents, gets it back. Hoists it forward. And there goes the final whistle. Denmark, winners of a no contest. They just swamped their opponents in superior quality. And after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? Yeah, and the result that was true to form, a big team beating a, a not-so-big team, and the lesson dealt. Well, thanks to Jim. We both wish you a very good evening.